Oh boy. Hey, what's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Boogie to 988 coming at you live once again through the power of the internet. And as you guys know, this summer, Sony has been kind enough to allow me to play some of their games for you. Um, and most of the games I've done as my character Francis, but this one, I was so excited to finally get to play. Uh, I, I had to do it as myself, just because I remember playing the original version of this game back in 1989. Look at that, 1989. Oh, the nostalgia. Oh. I was so excited. My solve a mystery. Or rewrite history. DuckTales. Woohoo. And uh, I remember this is like one of the quintessential NES games. Um, I had an NES growing up, and this game would have come out when I was 15 years old. I remember renting it um, and keeping it for a few days and, and just exploring every inch of it. And I can't wait to play it for you guys here today. Uh, when they announced the remastering of this game about a year ago, I just thought to myself, I absolutely had to get it, absolutely had to get it. And when Sony asked me this summer to play some games with them, um, for them, I told them, absolutely, as long as DuckTales is one of the games. So here we are. Hard Pogo, I don't know what that means. But uh, we're just going to start a game, and I'm going to go with Medium, because I'm not very good at these games. I'll try Medium so I get the hang of it, and then maybe later I'll go back and... Okay, we got a bomb. Oh no, they're trying to break into the vault. Ah! Oh, it's the Beagle Boys. Do you guys remember those guys from the cartoon? I do remember. Cuss me, Kilts. Me money bin alarm. Quick, Duckworth, get the limo. I shall uh, <clears throat> get up in gear, sir. This is kind of cool. There's cutscenes where the original game did not have any cutscenes like this. And I'm going to stop the cinematic just so we can talk, because I just want to get to the gameplay. I just want to play, I just want to play right now. Oh my god, this looks so good! Okay, Scrooge looks pretty much exactly the way he used to. Um, and he plays just about the same. Oh, hidden gems, I forgot how they would like, hide the gems like that. Okay. Oh, the background graphics are so cool! And of course he's got that high-end hammer tech security system. Uncle Scrooge! Huey! Are you alright, my- I'm gonna skip this cutscene, just so we can get right to the gameplay. Yes, I remember how to pogo jump! Get that beagle boy! Crack him in the head! Now that's what I call a stomachache! Stomachache? I hit you in the head! Yeah, Uncle Scrooge! Tell him! You're welcome, lad. But Huey, what are you doing here? Going into the money we? Sure. Louie and Dewey are here too. Those goddamn Better beagle boys. Alright, let's get moving. Oh, it's so cool. Uh, because this is exactly kind of the game I remember, you know. I, I Scrooge, the pogo jumps. Oh, so cool. And I remember they would hide gems everywhere. And of course, you'd. Okay, yeah, the chest, you bounce off the chest, you get the gems inside. Oh, it looks so cool, because I remember my original memories of this game are like NES graphics, you know? So to see it at this high-end graphics, I don't know. I mean, it's not that high-end, I guess, but how do I get those? Oh, off the... Oh, I bet I can't get them now, because I pogo... Damn it! I had to bounce off that chest, I bet. Alright, whatever. You don't have to get every gem, but I think, if I remember, there's a vault at the end of the level, and the more you get at the level, the more full your vault is. Crane swing. Cane swing, of course I remember that. Ow, I forgot a pogo. Alright, here we go. Oh. That's Dewey. Oh, they Get like away food. From him, you gluttonous goon. Sorry, Scroogey. Not a chance. They like food. What can I say? I I have that affliction too. All right, that triggers a hammer. That triggers a. And that triggers a hamburger, of course. Why wouldn't there be a random hamburger hand? It sticks out of the floor every once in a while. No big deal. You saved me, Uncle Scrooge. Yes, I did. I, I did. How you hurt a lot? Stay here. 
I'll handle this. Oh man, the voice acting for this game is phenomenal. It's just like the cartoon. It even looks like the cartoon. Oh, I gotta knock down the K. Okay. And then avoid the hammers. Avoid the hammers. My own security system was turned against me. Damn it! He dropped an ice cream cone! How did that not melt? Mmm, my scrub. Yeah, I knew there was gonna be gems. I knew there was gonna be gems there. Oh, man. I remember this game so fondly. And it feels like that same time all over again. Now, I read some of the reviews of the game, and some people complained that this was short. Um, especially for your $15, but. The nostalgia effect for me is worth $15, I guess. Um, but the original game was for short too. Oh, I bet I had the pogo off of that. Damn it! I can't even get the gems. I'm so sad, but that's okay. That's fine. I can get those if I. All right, well, there's a rock right there. Get the. I'm gonna get rock. Rock yawn. There we go, and then I can probably poke off of this one to get it. There we go. Oh, hammer time again! Da 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 da. da can't touch me! Da, da, da. Oh, you touched me! Stop it! Come on! Oh, the music is so good. Hold on, lad, and I'll have you free in a jiffy. Not so fast, McDuck. We're running things around. Not so fast, McDuck. One false move and I'm a roast duck. Please be a scrooge. It's not worth it. Oh, Louie. me, boy. Oh, it's never self-sacrificing, Louie. Damn it! You'll never beat us, Scrooge. Stay with fucking lasers. All right, here we go. Avoid the lasers. I can do this. Hey, Hit the button. When I get the gold, I'm Boom. Gonna what happens? Nothing. Man. I have to hit the top one, I bet. Okay, I'll hit the top one. This music is so good. The original soundtrack is like one of the best soundtracks of the NES. So I'm curious to see how they do the rest of this music. I gave that guy a hell of a stomach ache. Alright, here we go. Oh, there's that Beagle Boy that just hit. See ya! Get the hell out of my money pit, bitch! And then, no, no gems. All right. What about here? Is it the thousand Beagle Boys as you mentioned earlier? There's a thousand Beagle Boys. Oh, boss battle. Step away from me, fortune, you crook. Uh, 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 not this time, McDuck. Not this time, McDuck. Oh, he's got a helmet. Oh, you ain't getting okay, Pogo this off of his helmet. Boy. I don't know what to do. He's so tough and mean. Oh. Hello. Yep, invulnerable. But my butler summoned a safe, and then I bet if I cramp, right in the head. Ha <laughs> oh, Do be careful. You'll scuff the floor. He just kind of stands there under that. He doesn't really seem to care. Another safe, please. Thank you. Yeah. Ow. Ow. Here we go. Boom. Stop trying to hit me and hit me! Yeah, boom! Four hits, I guess it's five. It's five to kill him. Here we go. I got the whole world in my hand. Oh, that's a good boss battle. Curse you, my duck! This ain't the last you'll see me! What? Arrest him or tie him up or something! Don't let him go! Good riddance to I know this is a cartoon, but come on, man. Now, come on. Now, world was he interested in this old painting? Surely there are more valuable... It's probably nudes. Well, pluck me, pin feathers. It looks like some kind of secret code. Boys, it looks like some boys. sort of secret code. What did you find, Uncle Scrooge? Yeah, what is it? I'm not sure, but I know how to find it out. I'll feed it into my supercomputer. Oh, yeah, supercomputer. Analysis program. Back in the 80s, supercomputer is the equivalent of a modern-day cell phone, I bet. But okay, let's see what we got going. That's a big-ass computer. Can you imagine playing World of Warcraft on that? What is it, Uncle Scrooge? It's a treasure map, lads. And no ordinary treasure by the look of things. Oh, ordinary treasure. Any kind of treasure ordinary. Look! One of the treasures is in the middle of the Amazon. And 
I remember the Amazon level. I remember the Transylvania level. And the underground. You remember all of this. This is so cool. This last treasure can't be right. Yeah, there's no mountain on Earth that's that high. Well, according oh, man. to Junior Woodchuck's guidebook. I know where it is. 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 37 million steps straight up till we reach the moon. The moon! The moon, moon? The moon, 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 moon. Well, what are we waiting for? Oh. That treasure's no going to discover itself. Oh, now I heard it. I mean, look at this. You can you can go to the the Amazon, Transylvania, the African mines. But I heard a rumor that you can go to Uncle Scrooge's Money Vault, and if we can, we can. I'm gonna do. It. Yes! Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah! <laughs> oh my God! Oh, I've always wanted to do this. Oh. Oh, there's even an achievement! Oh my god! Oh, this feels so great! Oh, man! A oh, childhood fantasy fulfilled. It looks just like the cartoon! Oh, this is so fucking cool! Oh, I'm so happy right now. Oh, I'm so grateful. I'm so glad that they made this game. But I know what would make me even happier. Why don't we go... On an adventure. Me, you, Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Let's create a ducktail together. We go to the Amazon or Transylvania. We go to the African mines or the Himalayans. How about the moon? Let's go to the moon! Okay, maybe the Amazon. No, just kidding with you! Let's go to the fucking moon! <laughs> yes, I want to travel to the moon! Oh, I'm so grateful they made this game. I'm so happy to be playing it right now. I know that this game is going to end up being short. I know it's very much a remastered NES game. But for the price of a combo meal for two people, I can't imagine it's a waste of money. I highly recommend you check it out. Maybe you'll enjoy it as much as 15-year-old me did. Hey guys, it's Boogie. And I just wanted to say thank you for watching my gameplay video. If you click on either Stealth Incorporated or Cloudbreak Kingdom right now, you'll be taken to the other video I created this summer, so, and I think they both turned out pretty funny. But before you do, I would really appreciate it if you click on the link in the description box. Uh, this will take you to the PlayStation Store, so you can see the awesome deal they have on these games for the PlayStation Vita and for the PlayStation 3. But more importantly, it'll let the good folks at Sony know that you're watching and you're interested in these games. I really appreciate Sony for taking a risk and taking the opportunity to allow me to show you these gameplay videos. It's very difficult for a non-networked uh, partner for me to get these kinds of gameplay, uh, but I, they wouldn't take that risk if it wasn't for you. The bottom line is, if you guys weren't liking and watching and clicking the right things, there's no way they would have given me this chance. You guys are changing my life, and I love you for it. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon.